Hey, what's up guys? All right, so I just finished my RTA push. Um, I'm sure you can tell by the tone of my voice I'm not completely tilted. I think I think I'm safe. I work literally um RTA ends at 11 at the time of me recording this today. So, like in 19 hours or something. But um I work from 4 p.m. until after that. So, I'm not going to be able to play RTA at all. The last day, um, I stayed up until 6 a.m. playing it right now, and um, low-key kind of popped off. I, I figured out the meta again. Like, I swear, every time, like, like with new units come out, like the meta shifts, right? And it shifted hard at, you know, with the release of Rimuru, it shifted hard, and Kerouac. Kerouac is, like, really good. Like, super good. And Rimuru is super good, and I think Milam is really good, too. Um, I know a lot of people are thinking she's underwhelming. She's really not. I had, um, like, I'll show you a screenshot, like, right here. Like, <laughs> Milam actually solo carried against a Kisei and a Rim. That's actually insane. Like, not many other red units can do that. Like, Charlotte can kind of do that, but Charlotte into Rim is pretty sus, right? And even into Kisei. So, like, her being able to do that, like, she's definitely, like, won my seal of approval. I think Bruiser Millum is actually okay if you draft her correctly. But, um, I think she's pretty scary. But, so yeah, let's let's go in here real quick. Um, I'm going to attach some couple games from, from the beginning of my push where I was, I got pretty tilted, not going to lie. It was, like, right at the start of my push. Okay, well, the date changed. So let's do, go through this first. Give me, give me my check-in. actually need that um oh yeah i got Ooh, wait these are here already oh the hunt event oh it's a new event the summon event okay well, let's do our summons real quick i know this started today i have 14 free summons um so i ended up i think at, at 35 17 which is like two, rank 219 right now i don't think the uh, I don't think it's going to go higher than that. My, my original prediction was 3,400. I think it's going to be about 3,450 or so. Um, somewhere around there. It might go a little bit higher. That's why I didn't want to end at 3,450. Just in case it went higher. Because, yeah, people are, are going to grind like crazy the last day. But people are playing nonstop anyways right now. Damn near, right? People are playing like... Ooh, Sword of Judgment. I don't need that, but whatever. People are, are playing like nonstop already, so I don't think it's going to be much different than it is now. Except like some of the higher tier legend players that aren't pushing for top three kind of stop playing. So all the people that they would be fighting are now fighting, you know, the high crap, the, the top 200 crab players. And that's why I kind of stopped around rank 200 because I really don't want to start queuing into legend players. Um, even though like, like I had a pr pretty decent win rate against people in legend. Like, not at the end of the season, man. I don't want to get griefed or cheesed or cleaved, you know, by something that I can't really control. So, I figured out the draft. I'm going to talk through a couple of my games, and then I'll show you guys a couple of my early games. Um, I didn't lose all of them. Um, I don't know how many I'm going to show. But, uh, let's go back into the RTA. I'll talk through these drafts and kind of talk about how the meta shifted a little bit. So it really just turned into, say, I ended on a six win streak. That's why I opted to stop. See, I've already lost one rank, right? <laughs> From where, where I finished at. I, I'm still going to stand here. I'm not going to play anymore. I probably could keep playing because I was really, like, I really found, found what I needed to do. Like, I figured it out again. But, um,. Let's go down here. We'll start at the bottom. Okay, so I'm still doing the ban A Ravi if I'm not first pick. And then, um, you know, based on what their band is, is, is what I pick, basically. Um, so, like, he banned Rimuru and then went FCC first pick. So I immediately went into, like, AOL. I did not let my opponent take AOL anymore. She was a very high contested pick. So I'd much rather have her on my team and force a draft around this unit than fight her because she's a pain in the fucking ass. Right? So. I just went like this. Um, so I took these two. And then once I took this, he went made Belion. So as soon as I just slammed these two, he just lost the game. There was nothing he could do. Um, and then I actually sat on this last pick for a minute because I wasn't sure what I should pick. 
And I was like, Rylet's actually insane here. So I slammed Rylet, he banned it, because it didn't lose to the Violet, right? He knew I was banning Violet. But yeah, just win that draft. Here, um, I think I just ran this guy over. Like I'm running Injury Belion now, but like here, see, we both banned a Ravi, which is weird. I think I was looking away from the computer and I didn't know if I was first pick or not. So I just banned a Ravi. So normally I ban LQC, right? But since Rimuru was up and Ravi was gone, that's my other option for first pick is Rimuru. If I can't first pick a Ravi, I first pick Rimuru. And just go from there. And then when I saw he went Maid Crow, I instantly went into Belion and took the barriers away, right? And then when he went into Violet, I picked Milam Landy, which is just good into him. And then I, I didn't want to deal with Bizarre, right? This one, this is the only draft that I legitimately lost, like, that we're going to go through here. Um, so he first picked AOL, and I went with this. But me going with early pick Belion, he actually responded to it really well. And then he made the right ban. Um, if I banned FC or banned uh, her here, I probably would have won. But, you know, I was banking on maybe he'd ban Landy or uh, ban the... No, he drafted two anti blinds had banned Belion. So, I think he was... I, I was banking on him banning the Landy, I think. But, he didn't do it. And uh, it was just too much damage came out. Um, this guy, his rim, like, won the lottery. Hit literally everything. Stripped my Violet. Like, literally demolished my entire team. So, that just kind of happens, right? Um, I beat him here. But this guy, um, see, I banned LQC. Took the A Ravi. As soon as he went in AOL, I took Ricky. And took mitigation. And then when he went into this, I took, you know, I think Rowana's really good into her. She's really good into her. And um, Millen put in work this game. ML Care looks really good. I wish mine wasn't plus zero. This one, um, the same guy that I lost to earlier. Um, what did I have first pick last time? Oh, I banned the A Ravi because he was first pick. But this time I got A Ravi. And then he went into these two. So. When he went Rimuru and these two were open, I just took them, right? And then Ruel's just good in the Rimuru. And then I opted to go Kral since he went Landy because I wanted to be more aggressive. Sorry, I'm halfway yawning here. This one... His draft was actually fucking terrible. Um, so I got first pick. I took a Ravi again. He didn't have this as an option. I would have picked this here if he did. But first picking Rimuru, I just went into her and then took this. Because I was planning on picking Belion down here. But since he went ahead and took it, and he took Rim, so I couldn't take Rim, I just took both the Violets. And he didn't know what the last pick. So he just slammed Carmen here. Because I was going to ban this no matter what, pretty much. There was nothing else he could pick. So, and then he got greedy banning this. I don't know why he banned this. But, sorry, I'm tired. <laughs> but, yeah, he, uh, literally nothing he could do. This one... Another really shitty draft. Um, the first pick, A-Ravi again. He responds with these two. And then I take this, and I started picking Landy a little bit more aggressively. Um, it helped me out a lot. So, me picking Landy a little bit more aggressively, I think, is kind of smart right now. I don't know. Being aggressive is just the meta right now. You, you can only go full tank if you run Belion on injury set, pretty much. Like, you can't do condom drafts, drafts right now. It just doesn't really work. There's too much damage. There's Rimuru. There's uh, very good cleaves in the game, like Caesarea cleave, Charles cleave, um, just aggro in general. Aggro is just the meta right now. Um, it's shifted again. <laughs> um, but yeah, then when he went these last two picks, I was like, why did you pick Rim? That's worse than SSB. So, I was planning on banning this. I was like, you know what? I'll leave the rim there because this last pick is fucking terrible here. This literally does nothing. Did you think I was going to, like, ban ML Ricky or something? I'm not worried about that shit. I didn't even have to use her S3. I just, like, poked him. And then Landy ran him over. Like, he, there's literally nothing he could do. And then here. Like, people people are such in, a, in such a rush to take this unit that, like... They draft poorly. Like, his strays went first, killed my A-Ravi, and then I just revived her. And then he couldn't kill her again, basically. And I just slowly brought my whole team back to life, so... 
And then this guy, this is another terrible fucking draft. I don't know what the fuck this is. Um, I got the first pick, A. Ravi. He responds with these two, which is terrible right now. You don't do that. This is a terrible first two picks. Um, he left both of these open, so I just took all three of these. This is like fucking Exodia right now, dude. You, you don't let someone get these three units. It's very hard to beat unless you're cleaving them. This is literally fucking Exodia. And then he went Amelia. So I was like, uh, all right. So I was just literally hovering, hovering Politus because I, I figured. And then he took the T-Surin, which I have no fucking idea why. This might have been like a miss pick, but I think he was banking on like his Amelia to like outspeed me. Or something. I don't know. This draft sucked. But yeah, that's it. I'll show you a couple games from the uh, the start of my Q session. Um, I was about three, 200 points less than this. 170 points less than this. So I climbed up quite a bit. I went on, I think, an 8. I got up to an 8 win streak. And then lost a couple. Um, and then I, I had a little streak of bad RNG. I think I lost like 3 in a row. Under here. And then I won these two, lost two, and I started getting tilted again. Then I won six in a row. So it's just like, to keep a calm head, if, if I don't get it, I don't get it. You know, no point in being upset about it. Um, I might still not get it. But, you know, I tried. I quit, I quit this game for a year. So, like, for me to be able to quit for a year and then come back and still push this high, I probably could touch Legend if I, if I was off tomorrow and, like, I actually played all day. And really sat down and thought about my drafts and was taking notes on the people I was fighting throughout the day. I, I could touch Legend. I don't know if I'd hold it, but I, I'm pretty sure I could touch it. If I never quit, I would be top 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 30. I'm pretty sure. If I never quit and I had an extra year of farming under my belt, I'd be top 30 right now. But it is what it is. I, I, I play the game because I enjoy it. I enjoy RTA, even though it makes me tilted. I mean, literally every fucking game that I play that's competitive makes me tilted. It doesn't matter what it is. But, yeah, here's a couple matches. And, uh, yeah, peace. This is my last real Q session. Uh, if it doesn't go well, it doesn't go well. Like, I honestly don't care anymore. Um, I enjoy the game. I do enjoy playing RTA. Uh, if he's going to first pick Crow, I'm going injury blind 100%. So if this match is really boring, I'll skip through it for you guys. There's the insta pick Violet, and he picks Rowana. So he's going to fight the blind 100%, right? He's going to pick Rim too. We already know he is. And SSB. It's just like, I don't know. This crap's so damn annoying. Um, what else should I go with? Should I just go more aggressive now, or should I just go full wall? Because I can kill this stuff. I think I go Landy. And... I don't know. I'm going to go AOL, too. Might as well take it. And I'm probably just going to pick an aggressive last pick. It's just like, I don't know. I don't, I don't like this meta at all. Like, I was enjoying it for, like, a day. And then everyone realized how busted Blyan is. And then everyone built Injury Belion. Like, everybody has one. So if you don't have it, most likely you're fighting it. I'm probably going to ban the Rowana here. Um, I think I'm a last pick Stinny. Because he has a very bad draft in the Stinny. So people don't really think when they draft now. Like, they just pick RNG. You aren't even fit to kiss my feet. So we're going to do this. I don't have any sustain, and neither does he. He just bans my mitigation, and he's just banking on Violet soloing my team and all this other crap, right? Like, that's why I don't like this meta. It's actual dog shit. People just pick random units that are busted. Now, there's, some, like, there's literally zero thought to people's drafts. Um... This dude doesn't even have any buffs. Why not surrender? Taking point. I'm doing this just so I can uh, turn cycle faster. And double chance for guiding light to Brock. <laughs> I 
So we're just gonna get rid of this thing. I don't think he can win. If I hit the Violet here, I just instantly win. I, I don't think this guy can win. I don't need to use my AOLs S3. He counterpicked AOL so hard that he doesn't even get to do anything. Um, we're going to hit the Politus and pray. Okay, now we're going to Soul Burn and hit the Politus. We hit the Violet too. Yeah, this is over. Oh, it's 100% over. That's what you get for picking a casino draft, dude. Just gotta go more aggressive against these guys, I guess. I don't, I don't know. Like, this, this... this, this, What was this match, dude? Like, th these teams were both, like, dog shit. <laughs> like, like, looking at this, it doesn't look like I'm gonna win. I just... It like, didn't even matter that I banned this. I didn't get any value out of it. He just... Picked this random crap and these to counter this, and I didn't even have to use. And he didn't he ban the mitigation when he didn't even get to attack anything. Like people, this is the level of player that's up this high in top 1,000 now. It's because of these units. There's like almost no skill involved in this game anymore. It's it's just people pick casino. And then you have the the very select few players that gear gap everybody, and then you have, you know, there, there's actually there there is good players that just draft well, right? Um, but there's very few of those, I think. It, it's it's a lot of casino. It's a lot of praying for RNG to be on your side. There's no, I don't know, I don't want to say, you know, honor among drafts or whatever. You know, it's a gotcha game. Um, there's enough gotcha when you're summoning units and rolling gear. Like, why do you want to incorporate all this RNG into the PvP aspect of the game? That just kind of ruined it for me. Um, we're going Rimuru here, 100%. Yes. Honestly, I want to take LQC too, but I don't think I should. He banned AOL. Uh, I'm going to take Landy. Just because I don't want to fight it. Honestly. And I can go aggressive here or go tank. Whatever. So he picks Belion, of course. Predictable. Um, I'll pick Rowana just like the last guy did. Rowana's good into her too. So we just slam the Rowana pick here. It's probably injury. Kinda wish I could pick a Ravi, but Um So we have this. Do we need some mitigation? I think Crowl's not bad. Or we go see Armin. See, Armin for uh, immunity is probably pretty good. Let's just go see Armin. And then we, our last pick, we're kind of floating. So we can pick, like, an enabler like Amelia or... Yeah, so he just picks... Like, this, this guy's just picking bullshit too, dude. He needs to pick another da unit that does damage. Because if he doesn't, I'm going to pick, like, ML Ken. Or Violet. So he picks Politus. I can pick SSB, actually. Let's do this. And I'm going to ban the Bazaar. I don't know why he picked Politus. The SSB is a good ban, but... My Belion's going to actually do a lot here, I think. Yeah, we're going to steal immunity. Um, I'm going to go for the Politus. Wow. Okay. Well, I thought she might have died there. Guess not. My Rimuru will go again. Magic for friends, that's good for me, because it pushes me up. I 
I think we just go ahead and do this. He won't be able to break my land yet of stealth. At least, like, not right away. He's gonna have to S3 to do that. But I'll still have immunity. And Politus extra proc um, makes uh, procs Rowana too, which is good. I'm still scared of this Mercedes though. So we opt to not S3, I guess. She takes reduced damage from AOE now though. And I can heal immediately after this. He didn't soul burn that either, so he doesn't have his passive yet. We're just going to top off. I don't know if I'm going to win this or not. Like, this is a very iffy match. If I get rid of this Politus, I'm sitting pretty nice. Problem is, it's two greens versus two fire units, right? Um, that's... Not the right play, because you're just going to feed me CR. And he's got a lot of buffs. We just got to get rid of this Politus. Okay, we hit. That's good. Okay, if we can taunt this Mercedes. I'm actually fine if she just pops off with Elbrus because it's just going to get it's just going to give me CR. That's a good resist. Um ER imprints for the win, right? Uh, I'm gonna hit Belion here. Must I keep fighting? See if he soul burns it again. I don't think he learned his lesson the first time. Nope. The provoke was good. That's that's good there. I'm still in trouble here because of this Mercedes. Um, this Mercedes might just soul burn and kill my entire team. Pretty sure. She's really got high health though. So she might not do enough damage. We'll find out. Oh yeah, she does. Nope. Never mind. Rowana. This. That's not nice. Okay, Rimuru's got his S3 back this turn. And I think I'm gonna lap because of the speed buff and CR push here. If he pops magic for friends, he'll just actually push my whole team up, like, way up. Okay, we crit the Mercedes. That's good. He's probably gonna soul burn this. Maybe. He's got to try and deal with Rimuru somehow. But if he does this, then he just gives me more CR. And we got defense buff now. Alright, dude. Um... I'm just going to go for this. Nice. Okay, well, we actually won that. Two green versus two red, by the way, because these units are busted. Didn't even matter. Like, green versus red. Didn't matter, because Landy's a stupid unit. And Rimru's a stupid unit.